Hello everyone, this is Master Rabbit. I have a question. What if about the FNAF movie? Why is it so inaccurate when it comes to the lore? Well, what if, what if I were to tell you that the reason why it was so inaccurate when it comes to the lore, it's because, well, that's the thing. What if it was lore accurate the entire time? What if FNAF 2 focuses more on how it all interconnects to everything from all the theories around online, especially Matt Pat's theories, for my uh, opinion, to enter that scenario, to enter the dream theories shenanigans or whatever. What if, let's just say, William Afton used somehow the nightmare the nightmare animatronics to change the sound the, the sound use the sound discs the illusion discs to manipulate mike's memories using dream theory using remnant to manipulate mike's memories in order for him to forget who he really is what if the beginning of uh matt pat's part the third part of the fanav video regarding him discovering about his father's truth identity what if that's how fnaf 2 or fnaf 3 begins he learns basically here's a scenario let's say here's mike he enters his old house seems familiar he's like what the hell have i been here before walks in with abby so abby he and abby enter the scene enter an old room that for some reason clicks right there right there but Mike just can't remember. Abby, Abby has no idea. They enter the room, walk inside, see a giant elevator shaft going down, 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 downward into a massive underground bunker where they meet the sister location animatronics. Even the toy animatronics. All of them are there. Now... And the sister animatron, the sister location animatronics, the 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 fun time and fun times. It eventually ends with Abby being eaten by Baby. And thus, Baby is born. And thus, this turns out plot twist: William is there as Springtrap, who had somehow gained the will. To basically start moving despite his current state, his zombified state. William reveals to them, okay, I am your father. Classic Darth Vader style. And Mike, well, he tries to escape with Baby. Baby blames Mike for what happened to her. So Baby betrays Mike. Sides with William. Gets him scooped. Tricks him into getting scooped. And Mike, well, becomes scooped. Purple Mike. And thus, that is how FNAF 2 will go. And how would FNAF 3 would go? Well, of course, FNAF 3 has to follow FNAF 6, guys. Lore-wise, that's kind of like very cinematic university adaptation-y kind of. And I know it will piss off a lot of fans. But when you think about it, when you really think about it, you can't really place all of that in the movie unless you, like, make it brief, make it a cinematic universe. But FNAF doesn't have that kind of budget. I think, at least. Warner Brothers does, though. I will not, I will not count that out. Warner, Warner Brothers, of course, does. But the community of FNAF? I mean, Scott Cawthon, of course he has a lot of buckaroos, but... <sighs> Basically, what we need to do, even though we're a community who may hate or have mixed reactions with the movie, we have to support in the creation of the movie either way. Or at least they could find support in us. Because it's a movie for the fans. That is the point. What if that does happen? What if that is the storyline for FNAF 2? What if FNAF 3 
is much darker. It's R-rated. It's so bloody. Because we have scope mic there. What if? I do hope that they won't Minecraft movie it. I really do hope. But that's that. Universal, I mean. Universal, I hope you do this right. I have hope in you. I believe in you. Anyway, that's it, guys. What do you think of the theory? What if that does happen to baby? Hmm? What if that does happen to um, William Afton? What if Mike is William Afton's son? Remember, the dad, their memories were kind of wonky when it comes to their dad. He just mentioned he just left. What if the reason why he left was because he was actually William Afton? What if the reason why his face looks so different was because of the illusion discs? Hmm? Have you ever considered that? We don't know. We don't know. But if it's any consolation, Mike Schiff Schmidt, we could we we could also consider that. What if Clara's last name was actually Schmidt? What if that's his maiden name? His his mom's maiden name. But I don't know. I don't have all the answers. What do you guys think? Do you guys think I'm crazy? Do you guys think I'm... Hmm? Or am I right? I don't know. I don't have all the answers, guys. But thank you so much for listening. I really don't hope they don't Minecraft movie yet. I, it took some time to do the Minecraft movie theory. For this one, I've been thinking it for a while now. And the moment I thought of the FNAF 2 movie, this is what I thought of. But yeah, that's it. Thank you guys so much. I really do hope you all have a wonderful day. Thank you. Bye. Okay, okay. Why won't you turn off?